Um, greetings, you scum. Krusty here, and welcome to Ice, a new survival game which came out, which is said in the Arctic place with all the ice, hence the name Iced. It's all of ice in it, so they call the game Iced. Myself being interested in the whole survival genre, I decided I want to take a look at it. That's what we're doing now. Shut up, Krusty, play the game, you fool. Here I am in the tent, then. Um, I don't know why I, I'm, I gotta wait out here, but I gotta wait a number of days or hours or whatever, and then a rescue could potentially come. Then I gotta go outside, find a flare gun, shoot it up in the sky, and then they come and rescue me. That's it. That's the it. There's an end game to this. Let's just get that out in the open right now. There is a point. There is a f finish of it. Okay, so we have a radio menu here, which allows us to do a bunch of things. Um, I could take my hood off, which is kind of cool. I can put my hood on, which is also... Could take it off, put it on, take it off, put it on. So there's lots of cool little elements in this game that I'm going to be diving. I have goggles. <laughs> They're my favourite. So what do we have here? What is this? Is this inventory? Yep, that would be inventory. Okay, this is fishing. Um, can I get rid of inventory, please? Thank you very much. I got me a little fishing rod. How do I fish? Just sit here, I guess. Just. I just sit here and I wait. That's kind of boring. That's not. That's um. Maybe not. I don't know. I kind of want to get a fish. How long must we wait until? Got a fish. Oh, that didn't take very long. Oh, look at him flopping around like that, all all helpless and stuff. Because <laughs> Krusty's your master now. It's nothing personal, little fish. I'm just more important than you, and I need to be alive. And what is this over here? So we, we got the little little stove thing, and then we, we cook the fish on here, I guess. Do we do that? Do we do yeah? Is that is that what we do? Um got a little got a little knife. I'm just working these these oh I'm cutting the fish. Okay, that's um that's cute. Is that changed battery and that's put heat up and heat down, I guess? So I put the heat up. There we go. We have fire. Nothing bad can possibly happen now. And then Maybe I click that and put the fish over it there? Like that. I'm working this out. This isn't so difficult. I am in a tent. In a minute I'll go outside and I'll, I'll slip fall over and break my legs. Now do I have to tell him to stop cooking the fish or- No, no, when it's done he just does it. Cool, okay. Uh, well, well, turn turn that off now then, buddy. There you go, very much. Just actually- Now how, how hot can I make it? That hot. Okay, well let's not try to- Burn everything. Let's leave the tent now. Let's leave the tent. This seems like a great idea. Here we are in Snowy Snowsville. Now you got to be very careful walking around in Snowy Snowsville because you could slip over, you could jump too high, you could break your legs. I don't wish to break my legs. I have a nice little warm hood on, but I got to pay attention in the bottom left corner to my temperature and my mind and my water and my muscles. Oh, it's a game where I can see my legs. I really do appreciate a game where you can see your own legs. There's something down here. What is it? Get. Get it. What is it? Oh, it's a bottle of this stuff. Okay, I press... Okay, I press E to get it. Okay, so I, got, I just got a bottle of this stuff. Now, apparently, if you see something like that in the ground, there might be stuff around it. And you can dig through snow to potentially get more stuff which may or may not be around it. Also, I'm moulding the environment. This is the kind of power I possess. I can mold the environment around me. If I don't want snow here, I can just dig it away. I'm like a dog. I'm like a human dog. Look at that. I just made two holes. This is the power I possess. Don't I possess such power? You you, you, you think you're going to provide a problem to me surviving in this cold climate? Absolutely not. I know what to do. I cannot possibly be beaten in such a situation as this one. So the goal is to go around scavenging for things which can help you and assist you in surviving as long as possible. And you survive, as previously said, until the helicopter arrives. Am I crouching? Yeah, I was crouching. I thought I was going a bit slow. What a doofus. Kind of want to jump in the water. Looks cool, very refreshing, but that's a surefire way to freeze to death. And again, this is a survival game. I don't want to do it. Apparently, if you jump up and you can, you have a risk of like breaking your legs, so let's try that. I'm, I want to... I kind of want to. I kind of want to break my legs. Can I? Um, I'm guessing maybe I can jump over there. Yeah. Okay. 
Oh, I'm drowning. Oh, I'm drowning. How do I? Um, did I die? I'm drowning and dying. I'm dying. Okay, did I die? Did oh, I died? Okay. <laughs> That's what happened. That's what happened. Turns out, if you jump in that water, you die. So, jumped a little bit too far. <laughs> I died. Let's try again. By the looks of it as well, I'm, I'm actually meant to jump on the ice things. You know, like, like jump across, like, stepping stones to try and get to other pieces of landy places. I'm going to try and jump over that now. And this is going to go really well. The tent is just over there. I don't want to run away too fast or, or too far because I want to come back. Um, uh, it's, it's, uh, it's a warm tent. It has fish that I can kill. Uh... <laughs> I fell over. Okay, stand up. Stand up, buddy. Stand up. Am I okay? Yeah, didn't break my legs. That's good. Always a good sign when you don't break your legs because I need legs. I enjoy walking very much. Walking is a very important thing. Plus, if I jumped over there, broke my legs, then I wouldn't be able to jump back over very easily to get back in my tent and heal myself, I guess. I don't know how I can heal myself, by the way. I've got juice times two. I only picked up one bottle, but there's two bottles, so I'm a magician dealing in magic and illusion. How I could possibly fail this is beyond me. Is that something over there on the ice? Do you see that? This is I'm just going to run and I'm going to jump it. There you go. I fell over again. I'm a silly, I'm a silly goof. But there's, there's something here. Look. What's this? What, 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 what have we got over here? There's a foot. Is there a person buried underneath here? Does Krusty have a friend? There's a leg. We, we, we got a leg. We got a butt. Oh, look. What is that? Gas. Oh, cool. So that's that's more uh, fuel for my uh, furnace -y furnace. Sweet. This is going pretty well, I think. I mean, I found soda. Found a dead body. It's been quite a good day. I just kind of stroke him. I can make him feel better. I wonder if I can use the humans for anything. Like, uh, I don't know, like a scarecrow or something like that. Are there polar bears? Maybe there's polar bears I gotta look out for. You know, you gotta... Oh, a flashlight. That is pretty cool. That is... Inventory is full. Really? Well, shit. Okay, um... Oh, I, I seem to have... Jammed flashlight into your face. <laughs> I made a, a human unicorn. Told you I was magical. So a big point in this game is that the, you actually have nightmares. And that depends on your mental state. The dreams and nightmares that you have. I'm not really sure how much that affects the game overall. But I'm guessing it's kind of a big deal. Because the, the brain... The little noodles you got all bunched up in your head over there, they power you through such things, and if they're kind of messed up and unscrambled, then you're going to have a bad meal. That didn't make sense. Did it make sense? I think it kind of makes sense. If your brain is messed up, then you might have problems, what I'm essentially trying to say. Let's try and jump over this. There you go, see. I I slipped over again, but it's okay. I'm, I'm getting used to it. I'm okay with it now. I, I don't want to I don't want to go too far away, though. I'm getting quite far away, and I don't have a lot of inventory space. If I find something really good, or if there's like a sudden like burst of blizzard and stuff, then it's gonna you're gonna have a problem. Also, it's almost yeah uh, three o'clock in the afternoon. Basically, what I'm trying to get at is it's gonna be kind of dark at some point, kind of soon, and I need to consider that. If I'm wandering around out here in the cold, it's only gonna get colder at night time. So I gotta try not to be around here. And I don't know if there's animals and wildlife I, I need to be concerned with in this. Maybe I just dig in every little snow pile. That's the point of the game. You just go around and dig in snow piles all the time. That's, the, that's, that's basically all you do. How far can I dig down? Can I dig down to the ice? Maybe. Or maybe there's not ice under here. Just go straight to the earth. Be nice and warm inside the center of the earth. Well, I'm gonna head back to the tent now. And then I'm gonna go get some fish. It's telling me that I actually need to to drink some some of the water. Hey, I have a soda. I can drink that, can I not? I can drink some soda. Yep. Use. There we go. Should be fine. Should, should be fine. Apparently, you can drink some snow. You can melt some snow and drink some snow, or just devour snow, or whatever you want to do. But you can get kind of ill from it. So I don't really want to do that. I I, I I is there a safe way to do things that's like that so simple I'm making a song because I don't know what I speak mm -hmm. jump it <laughs> it's important to get your exercise out look the sun 
It is very, very slowly, quickly kind of going down. But I'm making my way back towards home now. So I should be... Oh, is that something? Is that something under there? We may have found another thing. It looks like we might have found another thing. Or maybe maybe, maybe we have, maybe we haven't. Uh, uh, what, what is it? Just, it's just ice, isn't it? It's just ice. Okay, I just found ice. <laughs> There's lots of ice. Everywhere. That bit of ice is not special. Where is that corpse? Oh, there he is. I can see his foot. <laughs> hey, buddy. I'm going to call you because... I thought I heard a noise, which was was very worrying, but I don't... I guess it's just the ice moving, isn't it? That's all, that's all it is. Hey, I'm going to give you a name. I'm just going to call you... First thing off the top of my head, I'm going to call you Grapefruits. Hey. <laughs> There you go. It's called Grapefruits now. It, it may it may seem like a stupid name. Oh no, I can no longer run. Okay, so I need to try and jump over this with without running. Oh. <laughs> Made that out to be a much bigger deal than it actually was. It's fine. Tell you what's not fine though, is nighttime is pretty much here now, so I need to I need to hurry up and get in that tent. I need to get some rest, I need to catch a fish and I need to eat it. Then I need to get some rest. Right, and then possibly encounter my first dream on my first nightmare. I'm not I'm not sure how that's gonna go, but I'm excited for it because it's getting very dark and the dark is scary. Into the tent we go. Holy shit is it dark. I should have picked up the torch. Should have left the gas thing, because I don't need that right now, and should have picked up the torch, but I didn't. Never mind. Let's um let's let's fish for for fish. I can see a little green light which tells me when it goes up and down, so I might be able to catch them. I mean, my vision is pulsating because I'm getting very weak and I need to eat something, but I'm not able to catch any fish. There's one! Got one! I got one! I got a fish! I got a fish! We're gonna be okay. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. You worry too much. Stop it. First of all, I gotta skin the fish. Uh, but I'm gonna do it in the dark with a sharp instrument. Won't cut a finger off. If I did, I'd eat it. Because... Survival. Let's eat the fish immediately, and then we can go to sleep somehow. And then, then we just... we just live. We just live. The point of this is to continue living to the point of rescue, and I'm not sure how long we have to survive until that point. But damn it, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna die. I will survive. Damn it, I will. Turn that off. Don't need it. Thank you very much. Um, how do I eat this? Oh, I, oh, it tells me what I have. I'm suffering from. I'm suffering from dizziness and leg trauma. So I was affected when I was jumping around on the ice like a maniac earlier on. Never mind. Okay. Why can't I not eat this fish? Are you telling me that I need like a knife or fork to eat a fish? How do I eat the bloody fish? Oh, I think I was in like a, a still in the cooking menu or something, so I, I should I can eat it now. There you go. Is that all it gave me? That much eating? That's not what that is called. Not eating. Okay, well never mind. Let's um let's go to sleep. Let's go to sleep. Hopefully I can survive through the night. On oh no, I, I need a drink and eaten as well. This is not going very well. This is not going very well. Boy, I sure hope I don't get a nightmare. Apparently my brain is pretty stable at the moment, so maybe I won't get. All right, I guess that was wrong. Um, what's happening then? Um, does it... Hey, there's a big door. That's totally... Let's head towards the big door. That's totally normal. <laughs> That's a completely normal thing to be able to do. I can run again, which is good. Door seems to be constantly... moving away. Um, I can... Don't worry, I can make it. The door seems to always be moving away. I can never quite reach the door. And that boat is... Boy, is that gaining speed. <laughs> Can I die in my dreams and my nightmares? I mean, it's not... This isn't actually happening. It's, oh, I fell in... Okay, gotta start again. Okay, so I don't actually die. I just start again. Maybe if I face my fears head on. Now, I don't stand down. You think you can scare me? This is my dream. This is my dream world. This is my mind. This is my brain. This is... Me. I will not so easily be frightened by the likes of you in my own dream world. For I have ultimate control here. You may be big, scary, and destroying all the ice in front of you, but you will not destroy me. What am I doing? Am I dancing? What am I doing? Are you making me dance? Am I, am I just meant to let it hit me? 
Is this, is this the right course of action? Is this... Am I, is, am I doing the right... F no? Okay. I'm gonna run away. Okay. I'm gonna run away. Alright. Let's not waste any time. How about this time we don't look around? How about this time I also don't accidentally move the mouse and almost run into the water? That sounds like a good idea, doesn't it? Now, Mr. Door, you seem to be constantly moving away, but I hope that is not the case. Or maybe you're just constantly getting smaller as I get close. I overshoot it. I overshoot it. I'm too keen. Oh. Okay. That was kind of interesting. I wonder how many different kinds of nightmares and stuff there are in this game. That was kind of... That was kind of interesting. Not more more fun than talking to grapefruits. I know that. <laughs> a lot more fun than talking to a corpse in the snow. Because they're not, not great for the conversation. I also saw different ice holes outside as well. So maybe you can get bigger and different types of fish on the outside. It's a bit riskier to go and do it, but mate, there's a fish, there's a fish. Hello, little fish. <laughs> I'm going to keep getting loads of fish. I'm going to get just gather loads of fish. I really need to drink, though. Drinking is a thing I need to do. Um, I'm getting dizzy. See, my mind is going all weird. Okay, so I have two fish right now, but more importantly than actually eating things is... Um, drinky poodles. So why don't we go and see if we can get some snow? Um, it might make me ill, but that's fine. It's not as if I really care. Oh, okay. Sorry to say, some snow. That's good. It wasn't yeah though either. So that's that's extra good. That's extra good. Which is a point. Where am, where where am I defecating in this place? <laughs> is it down the same hole I fished down? Is it? Am I in danger of fishing it back up? I hope not. Really hope not. Okay, that should be uh that should be okay for drink. That that's not a good sign. What? Oh, I died. Okay, I died. All right. Now we turn to a question which is surely on everybody's minds: How just how can Krusty end this video in a very magnetizing, compelling? exhilarating kind of a way which lets your mind just spin all around with creative thoughts and you just get so excited you can hardly breathe how can he do this how can he end the video in such a way the answer is very simple he can't so bye <laughs>